Okay, listen, it's time for some redemption on stream today. I had several failed runs that ended up losing to Terra Morphus of all people, and th that simply cannot stand. So we're going to be playing some Maya today, a little bit of Siren for your life, phase lock and roll. And I believe that we will win. I believe that we will win. I believe that we will win. And uh, yeah, that's all you need to know. Now let's open up some chests and see if we can get a good starting room. Oh, I see some purple and I see some blue. Um, a times two shoddy does do something. I'd, I'll take a green or a, a purple green Aegis. I think that could be a, a decent starting weapon. Uh, Nova Shield. An Umbridge. Malawan weapons. I mean, name a, name a more classic combo. Maya and Malawan. For real, for real. Oh, these look nice. Incendiary damage, pistol damage. Ooh. Okay. I'm liking where I kinda like where we're at. A uh, Vladov Pushka. Yeah, let's do it. So do we have any fire weapons that we can use? I know we have got a corrosive weapon that we can use, but if not, that's fine, because we can just go pistol damage. Alright, let's start off with there's a couple different ways to start. You can go accelerate first, and honestly, that seems pretty decent. But I like to have the magazine size and the reload speed. It's just, it's just a really nice DPS increase across the board. Let's go. Okay, wildlife exploitation preserved. This might be some robots, or it might not be. Okay, well, no robots, but that's okay. A fire damage weapon or a fire damage grenade would be nice here. Cooldown rate, 41%. I think that could be good. Not bad. We got a rabbit skag. I always get rabbit skags when I don't have the means to take care of them. Either way, let's let's just slag them up. Slag them up and, and Tesla them down. We stay inside the Tesla, so that way they have to stay inside the Tesla. It's our it's a it's a strat as old as time, just like that. Bada bing, bada boom. Now, open up the chest. Uh, a homing Tesla. I need I need some more time to think about that. Before I make a decision, a yak skag, a barb skag, toil us at my feet. There you go. You guys stay inside there while I take care of this laddie right here. And we're using the purple one. I kind of want to use. Oh no, I can't use the purple one because it's corrosive. Got to make sure. This is we're on ultimate vault hunter mode. There's big. You get you get big uh, bonuses for using the right element and big downgrades for using the wrong one. So we're gonna be a little bit careful here. Let's just take out a Sky Hunter. It's easy enough when you're playing Maya. Yeah. Take this time to get a chest up top. We're not really being pressed right now. Let's see. We got ourselves a, a flat off Droog. That's going to be an absolutely unstoppable weapon in the early game. And with it, we're going to be going at incendiary damage. This is definitely going to be a one shot. Oh, not quite a one-shot, but close. Good. Maya's a really good sniper class, so it's going to be nice to have this fire droog the entire run. All right. Put up the skag. Whoa! Somebody hit me. I'm. Oh, I am getting hit right from behind me. Oh, a little stab and bag. Ultimate badass, corrosive skag. Okay, he's just dodging all my shots. Let's put this guy up and tell us if we can land some crits. There we go. Super nice. Huge, 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 huge. Okay, let's get these. Let's clear out these chests as soon as quickly as we can. That was a pretty nice first round. Pretty nice first round. Now, as far as our next five points, accelerate might be what we do. We could go Helios as well. I, I like to get down the right side tree as quickly as possible most of the time. Um. But I'm, I'm pretty happy with where we're at as far as uh, weaponry because we do have this. I think it's an umbrage. Oh, let's see. Hmm. The Jericho. It's not a Snyder. I mean, we could try the Jericho if, if it comes down to it, but I, this seems like a, a pretty decent pistol. Alright. Open it up. I'm also going to check back here for a pressure pad or something. So I haven't found it. Oh, yes. Let's go. I have never found it on this map yet. So let's do it. There's a bushwhack. And I, you guys know I am partial to the bushwhack. Hmm. If I wanted to go. I want to compare the stats of, of the grace 
versus the gospel. Looks like the... This grace in particular has better stats. Or this gospel has better stats. We might try it out. Um, as far as the other weapons that we're... We can take a bushwhack. It's a bushwhack with a bandit grip. Oh, I picked up the wrong weapon. That's okay. It's good to know that that's there now. I've never uh, actually found it. But now that I know where it is, I'm a happy boy. That's all the secrets on this map found, as far as I know. And let's take five points. I like... I like personally like, like to go Helios. He has the cloud kill faster. Get his overall damage up much, much higher. Much, much faster. Alright, what do we got? Some pistols. None of those are speaking my language. One more red chest to go. Decent round one. We got some decent weapons. Ooh. No, we're not going to go with that. Oh, loot midget, loot midget. Let's go. What a find, what a find. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna want to slag this guy probably more more like most likely. But what we want to do first is let's do some cooldown, right? All right, where are you at? Get slagged. Not getting slagged at all. And he's gotta be slagged, right? No way he's not. Okay, okay they finally the, the slag finally went through. Alright, put him up. I'm glad I opened up that chest. Let's go. Alright, what do we get? A blood of the ancients. Max health, pistol max ammo, and shotgun max ammo. Ah, <sighs> I mean. I don't see it. I, I really don't see it being that great for us. I would much rather just run my cooldown, to be honest with you. All right, we got some, we got some enemies we got to take care of now. Keep going. We have a grenade that can help us out, and we do got Teslas, so that'll be good. Shoot that to knock him or to get him slagged up. Okay, get back inside the zone, brother. Got to be careful with these laddies. Back up. There we go. Run forward. Back up. Huge. Run forward. Back up. And to get myself a little bit more space here. Not waste. Let's not waste any ammo on these guys. Okay, gotta make sure we're watching both. It, it, it can be easy to get cornered by them. Run this way. Huge. Okay, what do we got in here? A longbow Tesla with a much better uh, fuse time and more damage. Also at this guy's feet. There we go. Here comes the ESP loader. Let's, let's walk forward, back up a little bit. Oh, we're hit. We're hit hard. We're hit hard. Losing our HP here sucks. Crouch. We're going to need some more Tesla grenades down for sure. I got no cover. Crits are a must. Crits are a must. I'm not even, I haven't been aiming for crits. I need to aim for more crits. Get both my grenades down. <clears throat> Left. Right. Looking Gucci. Looking Gucci in the hoochie. Very clean. Alright. Full loader. Where's my crit? That's okay. He looks like he's going to go down anyway. Alright. 13 out of 15. Looking good. No grenades left. Left, right, EXP loader. Let's just put him up for now. Yeah, huge. Nicely done. All right, we managed to survive that round. We only took a little bit of damage, so that's good. Remember I slag singularity? Right now, I'm good without it. Ooh, that looks nice. A high terror morphous. It's a super big, super big shield. Oh, that one's even bigger. <clears throat> that one's even bigger. Let's just go with that turtle shield instead. 
Here we go. Pressure pad me. Wow. I mean, those are some, I mean, those are certainly options. I'm not going to say they're good options, but they're certainly options. Got two more red chests and one more standard chest. Adaptive shield could be nice. But I kind of like the idea of a turtle shield. What you got? There's another bushwhack. I believe that is matching grip. Where's my bushwhack? I kind of want... I just want to... Ooh, no. Just kidding. It's an anarchist, though. It's a good pistol. Mine's, mine's probably going to have more damage. I just want to see, though. It's purple. Yeah. Even so, I really like the Jacob shotties. Let's see. Nope. Five more points. And Cloud Kill is definitely going to get a point into it. With... Let's do Chain Reaction. When you have an enemy phase locked, all of your shots that hit enemies have a chance to ricochet and hit nearby another nearby enemy. Okay. Yeah. It's like Ties That Bind. <clears throat> ties That Bind from Borderlands 3. All right, Friendship Gulag. Let's see. Longbow Corrosive Cloud. That could be a better grenade just for this area. Let's toss it down. Toss it down. There we go. We have Cloud Kill. We have Corrosive Cloud Grenades. We should be just fine against all kinds of loader enemies. Very easy. Put this guy up. Knock him down. Cloud kills just a, an, a huge buff for the early game. Look at that. Huge damage. Hey, don't do that. Just put, put him up and put him down. There we go. Maya makes it a little bit easier just to, to do the basics of the game, you know? Kill flying enemies quickly. Have good accuracy. Huge. Didn't even have to leave the, the main area back there thanks to Cloud Kill. And I still have my Droog in case I had run up against some people that need to take damage from fire. Let's take an SMG. Relic. Keep my eye out for some good SMGs. Let's see. Cooldown rate, it's even better. 43% instead of 41. 2% cooldown. Could it be the difference between life and death? Let's run back here. We know where a lot of the pressure pads are now on these maps, so... Stick with me, you learn something. See, a falcon? A horror shell? How much less damage is that than a droog? It's more damage than a droog? That's interesting. I probably should try it, but I'm not gonna. Okay, here we go. Here's some class mods. My current one does what? Oh, Mucka Mucka at 107,000? That could be good. Let's do Reaper. And slap on a Mucka Muck. Let's see. Leap and Backdraft. Oh, I see. That could be like a... That could be like a... A melee style type class mod. Team cooldown rate and plus five Reaper. Yeah, I think that's what I'm going to want. Now I'm going to have a lot of points in Reaper, right? Yeah, 10 out of five in Reaper. That's going to be good. Okay, let's go. If I can land crits, I'm pretty sure it's going to it's gonna hurt a lot on these guys. All right, land crits, land crits. See ya. See ya. Take our time. Let's take the muck, muck out. Let's see if we can one-shot this guy. How much did that do? That did a pretty good amount. Oh, that's a miss. Nice. Okay. Taking our time. Let them come to me. No reason to get overzealous here. 
watching the minimap, seeing if this guy gets any closer. It's I think it's one of those really slow enemies. Oh, I missed. You go up. And then you go down. Muckamuck uh, Maya goes crazy. You guys don't know that. The Muckamuck, as far as I'm aware, is the higher damage option of the Jacob Snipers. Kill you. And while you're up, kill you. Not not a good shot. Oh, I'm, ta I'm taking damage? Or I thought... Yeah, no. Hmm, I wonder. Mad Dog, back off, bro. Don't do it. I told you not to do it. See ya. Oh my gosh, that's some deeps right there. Miss Moxie's good touch. Now, that could be a really good um, SMG for us. A really good SMG. There's a lot of stuff to open up on this map, so. Take all that stuff. Pistol damage, slag damage. I don't have a slag damage relic yet. Shoot this bunny. Now, the Muckamuck is bolt action, where some of the other Jacob snipers are, are not. Makes him a little bit weaker, but the extra damage is so much higher. Alright, show me what I show me what you got. Well that rate 47% and some Vladoff damage. We're getting a lot of good relics. SMG 108% mind's eye and wreck. Holy. That's pretty good. Now, what can we take? Chain reaction. Let's do immolate in case we go down and the next time we go over one. Looking okay. I like the cat class mods because they just offer so much damage. That's kind of like their whole idea. Now this could be a... Honestly, this could be a... We could go a melee Maya build. I wouldn't be against it. Let's take this one before we head out. Alright, what you got for me? Looks like Jacobs. And that's a Droog and a Scout. Okay. Looking alright. Amp shields are good on Maya as well, because you every time you get a kill, you can regen your shield up. Alright, our final bunny is right there. All three bunnies. More loot. More loot tinks. More loot midgets. How's our launcher right now? Bad. Alright, let's take this one. Now, we're, we have a, we're having a lot of different options right now as far as what we should... What can we go? The good touch... The problem with the good touch is that it doesn't do that much damage. It heals... But it doesn't do much damage. And that's my biggest problem with it. I kind of want to see, like... Did I keep... Oh, I didn't get... I didn't keep that, that Breakneck Banshee class mod. I wanted to see, like, how... How good we could make it. Like, running around at Mach 5 with a hide of Terramorphous. I'll keep my eye out. Right, for this guy, we're definitely gonna want. Let's try it. Let's go. Let's go SMG, and instead of the Drew, let's go a Good Touch. And we can rely on our. We can rely on our Phase Lock to help us out with shields and stuff like that. Okay, see ya. Not bad. Okay, we can put him up. That's good. Get that burn damage going. He resists, but the good touch is doing some good damage right now, actually. More than it does in any other class, I feel like. I feel like other classes when I get the good touch, like especially Krieg, it just leaves a lot to be desired. Alright, put him up again. That's pretty good damage on that guy. Okay, and I'm down. Wow. I need to shoot my launcher at this guy. 
Huge, huge. And let's take one of these bad boys. Just one. And melee. Let's go. Okay. We're okay. Hellbinder, class mod, Helos Reaper, and suspension. That's pretty good. Wow. I right, open up some chests here. We got a fast cannon. Quality special. Juso's candy. Yeah, that one's pretty nuts. What do we get from here? A good touch. Is it better than mine? Oh my gosh, it's better in every single way. That's crazy. A yellow jacket? You can kind of... Most of the time, miss me with that yellow jacket. But in this case... Oh, wait. A plasma caster. The problem with the yellow jacket is that it's, it's shots fire so slow. Meanwhile, I can just go this bad, Larry. And it's TDR, so I can do reloads. The little Eevee. How is the little Eevee? I'm going to pause it just because I'm pretty sure the Eevee gets its cooldown reduction. I'm going to be right back and make sure. So after getting a kill with the little Eevee... Uh, you get 12%, uh, you get 12% action skill cooldown, which could be pretty good if we're able to actually get kills with it, which, yeah, it could be pretty nice. Now, we take one point in Ruin, and we're done with this tree. Let's go ahead and put one point in Mind's Eye. And I think Accelerate, hmm. Yeah, we're gonna go Accelerate. Let's do it. Okay, not bad. Not terrible. Not terrible. Let's continue to collect up. Now, we we have some decent SMGs to run now. We just don't have a lot of SMG max ammo is the biggest problem. But don't worry. We're going to have some SCU. So I want to make sure I open up these chests and get as much iridium as possible. Now, what I could do... It's not going to work, though. I said I, I could take that candy and try to one-shot the raid boss, but it's just going to take too much time. No iridium. That's that's bad luck. Bad luck. Or how about some? Maybe some in here. Still no iridium. <laughs> that's okay. Any more red chests around that I haven't opened? Looks like we're all tapped out. Alrighty. So do we want to go plasma caster? Or do we want to go Yellow Jacket? I think we stick Yellow Jacket. And we're going to have... I mean, if we get Terramorphous, we're going to get... We're going to get revenge on Terramorphous with our with our good touch, I think. Hopefully. But the first thing we want to do is max out our... Oh, what is it? Holy moly, bro. Yeah, we're going to max out our SMG ammo for sure. We need to at this point. Now we get two pulls of the box. Let's take two pulls of the box. Yes, a legendary cat. Oh. All right, show me the money. Okay, grenades, grenades. Longbow electric leech and a longbow pandemic. Let's take the longbow electric leech. And I'm going to empty out some inventory. See you guys in a second. All right, y'all ready? Boom. Oh, that's a cool one. Right, let's pick up this pandemic. And we have a relic that gives us uh, SMG max ammo plus 64%. And I think that could be what we need. That could be what we need for this next stage. And I'm not going to design my character quite yet. Because honestly, if this run dies, I'm not going gonna, gonna, not, not to want to waste my time doing that. Okay. We can do this. This is definitely feasible. Now, what we want to do is take one shot with a plasma caster and reload. I think that's gonna all, all we're gonna need to do. Hopefully. Let's see how much damage we can do. Come on now. Get a little bit closer. Take our one shot. You get slide, brother. Boss. Boss. Those are big chunks. Pretty big chunks coming out. Okay, he's invincible. That's good. Grab a bad touch and let's do this. 
We have a lot of ammo with it for our SMGs. Which is good. You go up. And you go down, brother. Very good. Where are you going? <laughs> Don't want any pods to evolve, though. I right, switch over. Fire. Good. Very good damage. Coming with these TDR reloads. Toss. Let's toss a, a leech. Not bad. And a good touch to heal back up. Okay. Now you're down. Now you're down. Very good. Still at full HP, pretty much. Good Touch is doing a good job healing me. Haven't had to use any of my leeches. Alright, use this. Toss. Make sure that all these tosses hit. There we go. It hit. It hit. Toss. Not bad. Still have a thousand H, a thousand rounds left. How about this little Eevee? Is this thing gonna do good damage? There we go. Action skill cooldown. Oh, please don't go. Please don't bug out. Yeah, this little Eevee is actually kind of nuts for a cooldown. Oh, no, 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 no. You need to die. Oh, chain reaction popped off right there. Huge, huge, huge. Yeah, let's just use a little Eevee for mobbing because it gives us that cooldown right after every kill. Where are you, Terra? Or not Terra. Brawl. There you are. Oh, I'm gonna take a hit here. No, I'm not. I'm good. Toss a couple of grenades out. Toss. This might be the last phase, hopefully. Oh, that's a whiff. That's a whiff. You go up. Toss. Toss. Take the, take the, take the damage. It's fine. Huge. Okay, we got the win. Ooh, we didn't even need the Juice Hose candy at all. Let's go. Very nice. Yeah, that, that Plasma Caster really helped that a lot. Those TDR reloads come, come in handy. Any legendaries or anything on the ground? It's really hard to see in this, in this stage, to be honest with you. Nothing. I don't see anything good on the ground. I don't want to miss it, though. Hmm. Is it over here? Oh, corrosive damage. That could be Dece. It looks like we didn't get anything good from the crawl fight. Stop. How about from here? A Tattler or a Seraphim? I like, I like the Seraphim, but I think the Tattler's more a tempo this round. Very good. Oh, here we go. No, it's not it. Dang, where's my loot, brother? Well, I think I just searched the entire stage and I didn't, I didn't get a single... I didn't get anything above a purple. Guess it is what it is. Alright, we still get all these chests to open up. Hopefully we get something good here. Mmm, mm-mm. Oh. Okay, another another TDR <laughs> E-Tech. It's my third one of the run. What you got? That looks pretty nice. I believe in us. Come on now. I mean, oh, we we got a Tyler. That was the only thing that we got from this. That's a that's a bang stick. Okay, never mind. We keep going. 
Not the best loot. I mean, we could have gotten something like a peak opener. But. Seem to be doing just fine. Don't fall. Not a problem. Not a problem. Again, tier 2 is when we're going to be really testing our damage out. Hopefully this Tadler can help us. Yes. Drop down. Huge. I believe it... Yeah, it's a times 3. With this... Almost the same damage as the Plasma Caster. The Plasma Caster does 254,000. This is 217,000. But it's times 3, so... Yeah. I think it should be Dece. Thank you. Tier 2 unlocked. Let's go next. This is our run. I think I, I, this is our run. Oh, what you got for me? Let's see here. Nope. Nope. Again, we have too, we have too many good weapons to be to be using trash. We have shotguns for every. We have plasma casters for every occasion. Oh, I'm worried about this stage a lot actually i'm i'm quite worried about this stage okay so the tadler is probably gonna come in handy we gotta kill this mage mage has gotta die huge mage is dead the mages and the necromancers you just take so much damage on this stage and it feels like there's no like rhyme or reason why Gotta kill the Necromancer. That's good damage right there. You kill the Necromancer, and the Skeletons go with him. Like, look how much damage this takes to kill that guy. Whoa, Skeleton. Well, wow, that's slow reload right there. Yeah, and I go down. Like, I, this stage is gotta be amongst the hardest stages. Come on, go down. Yes, okay, we're, we're making it work. I've actually never beaten this stage. This, this stage feels like a boss stage to me. Every time I get here. There we go. These skeletons reflect every single bullet. Come on, go down. Why are you so tanky? Dude. The tankiest enemies known to Earth. Finally. Oh, I've never beaten that stage. I'm pretty sure. Feels good to beat it, but man, they're they're like just so much stronger than every other type of enemy in this whole this entire DLC. To be honest with you. Ooh. Okay, I can breathe for a second again. Any more good loot? We can take five points here. Let's take some points into Accelerate? Mind's Eye? I know I need Sweet Release, I do. I understand. Lawful Good? Oh, these are the, the Tarantina comms, I see. They're worth looking at, for sure, because they're interesting. Well, let's go. What you got for me? Let's see. Melee damage or Breath of the Seraphs? Neither one. Neither one. I know what you're thinking. Uh, you go you go uh, SMG build every time. One, I don't. But two, I have yet to get a win on my SO. I, I, I deserve to go whatever build I want. The most powerful build I can possibly conjure. Are we just are we just gonna get tough enemies after tough enemies after tough enemies or what? Bone crusher, you're gonna go down, brother. Sorry. I don't need to reload. I'm good. Later, kid. Accelerate is helpful here for sure. Ow, ow, ow. I don't need to check these too much. All right, to put you up in the air. And knock you down. Wow. Yeah, this, this stage is loud because the echo from the walls around. 
Crouch. What's nice about the the this this Tadler is that it only absorbs one ammo per shot, or only uh, shoots one ammo per shot despite being a times three. Oh, your buddy left you, bro. What happened? Nice. Tough enemies usually spawn here. You have ultimate badass. I don't need to kill him. I can just kill this guy. Boom. Round over. Alright. Show me what you got. Let's see. Might of the Seraphs. Auto idle. Mm. I'm not about the auto idle when I have so many better options. Let's take some... I like so many of Maya's skills, to be honest with you. One point in Wreck and three in Sweet Release. That, sh that should be very helpful for us. Anything over there? No. Let's get this one. Get me in. Thank you. Okay, we're fine. Very nice. What can make this run even stronger? Uh, I would like some a launcher that that sends me over the edge. Because right now our launcher leaves a lot to be desired. A Thompson, but we're just kind of on a different track. I do like the Thompson, just not in this character. I mean, it's good on her. It's just not. It's it's outclassed. Okay, let's go next. A legendary uh, cat class mod to pair with our amazing plasma casters. Again, I don't think I have a fire one, right? I've got shock. I do got a fire. Good touch, though. Use this. And this will also keep me alive. So let's just mix it up. We don't have to run the same up in every stage. Keep it simple. All right, enemies, where are you at? Yeah, I don't want to move up too much because I know they're going to spawn in on me. Bone Crusher. Wreck and Sweet Release. Got some... I got some phase lock synergies now. I don't need the SMG max ammo relic at the current moment. I can go for a cooldown, right? Rugged Marauder, you're gone. Oh, Nehi Nomad, that's funny. I like that. Arshel Mathers. I'm zoning off of one joint, popping the limo. How about the window? Shopping a demo, I'm gonna point. There we go. A little bit of chain reaction did, a, did work against that guy. Now we're Now we're ripping him. Feels good. Stage two? More like stage zero. See you later, brother. Sorry. You tried to sneak up on me, but I had my eye on the minimap. Gotta be careful. You don't want to get caught off guard. Crouch here. Am I getting flanked? Not quite yet. Soon I will be, but I only need one more kill, so. Whoever our phase lock is gonna get ripped apart. Nice. Alright, what do we get? Extra shot chance. Okay, assault rifle damage if we get... If we get the right assault rifle would be huge. Would be absolutely large. But until we get it, it's not going to be as good. Let's do... More wreck. More sweet release. And then I might go left side tree for, for more phase lock shenanigans. See, cooldown, Jacob's magazine size now. This is the game that we all play. It's called Borderlands 2. Boop a doop boop. Even after all these years, like the, the mechanics still hold up, at least on PC. I've played it on console a few times. Um, and I feel like on console it's a little bit rougher, but on PC it still feels really, really good. 
Okay, it's basically mine but better. Let's go next. One more stage and then the boss stage. Okay, this is gonna be Mad Mike for mini boss. Alright, do we shoot televisions? I think we do. Okay, you're gonna get roasted, Frando. Let's just get some bullets down that way, even if they don't hit. Supply some pressure. Let me take bomber. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna deal with you, bro. Can reaction doing work? Huge. Right, so I think this person might be up top. I don't want to die though. To something random. I got check. Okay, now let's, again, when I go up here, I do not like staying in this middle section. I want to find a way up. Let's use these stairs ASAP. Run away. Oh, no, no, no. Don't get stuck. Don't get stuck. Don't get stuck. Okay. Ah! You need to go up. Need, again, he does not resist fire to the head. And now when I'm here, let's destroy some barrels. I need to, I need to back down a little bit. Okay, I'm getting completely flanked. If you, if you stay down here, you die. You gotta keep you gotta keep moving. Oh, again with my movement. What is going? Why is that so? That last step is so hard to climb for absolutely zero reason. Who's shooting a shotgun at me? You. Good thing he was out of range, but. Okay, things are looking okay. This guy's making his way to me, but I can just phase lock him. You know, just my things. All right, let's shoot the second TV. All right, Nomad Tyrant. Get phase locked, brother. Is what it is. This character is kind of busted. That's why I like the player, to be honest. All right, we got... Mad Mike is officially spawned. Oh, I want to get better at climbing these stairs. I gotta... So if you try to run up these stairs regularly, you get caught in the last step. Just like that. You see that? So if you run up the left side, yeah, you, you get caught. So you just gotta jump up them. Wow. Okay. I'm sorry, bro. I was just trying to... I was just trying to show somebody something. I'm sorry. No. Mad Mike, I hate you. Not good. No, bro. No. I get punished? Are you serious? Oh my gosh. I can't believe I just messed with Mad Mike that much to get punished that hard. Oh, wow. What a run. What a run. Anyways, if you enjoyed, hit the like button. Subscribe to see more videos like this one. And I will see you all in the next one. See ya.